The National Communications Authority had earlier rejected an offer by Telesel to take over 70% of Vodafone shares. The regulator, in refusing the offer, said that Telesel's offer request did not meet the regulatory threshold for approval. Communications Minister Esla Owusu Ikufu was also quoted as saying that Telesel Group was unsuitable for the takeover of Vodafone Ghana. Although Telesel confirmed it had signed a sale and purchase agreement with Vodafone to acquire a 70% stake in its Ghanaian subsidiary. The minister is also quoted to have said that Telesel did not have the financial muscle and capacity to run Vodafone after the takeover. But in a sharp U turn, the NCA has gone ahead to give conditional approval. According to the NCA, Telesel resubmitted a revised financial and technical proposal in December 2022, which demonstrated the needed capital investment to extend the deployment of 4G and launch innovative fintech solutions. According to the NCA, the revised proposal provided more clarity and certainty in terms of the funding required for the acquisition and commitments from both the seller and the buyer.